Hi guys, welcome! Have you guys tried the new Shikigami Mikasi yet? Do you like her? Are you possibly looking to get a skin for her? Well, if you're a bit like me, you might be curious to see how the skin looks like in-game before purchasing since sometimes the skin in the interface may look slightly different in-game. In this video, I've combined clips to showcase all her different skins, including her evolved skin. If you're curious to see what's new for Miketsu, please keep on watching. Let's start with her recolored skin, Green Spike. Noticeably, her hair is more red-orange in-game rather than pink in the interface. I was actually considering getting this skin because I wanted pink hair on her. Unfortunately, it actually looks more orange than pink, although some of you guys may like it that way. I don't know. Also, her fox is white and purple, which is different from the interface. In the interface, her fox has no purple, rather it's just white and gray. The effects are still the same as the original skin. Next, we have her rare skin, Bountiful Harvest. Megetsu has just arrived and yet she already has a rare skin. Do you guys feel the hype? Anyway, this skin has new skill effects. Let's compare it side by side with the original. Here's a clip of her skin in game. Overall, the new skill effects doesn't veer away too much from the original, probably because the color theme of the new effects is still the same. However, her fox is a bit bigger from the original with a really big poofy tail. And the fox is really white, unlike her recolored skin which is actually purple and white. Lastly, we have her Evolved Skin. This can be unlocked at Grandmaster Proficiency or if you have the Evolved Form Amulet. I made a video explaining the Evolved Form Amulet and I'll leave the link in the description box below. But in summary, the Evolved Form Amulet can be obtained from the Recharge event and can be used to waive the proficiency requirement on the Evolved Form Skin. You can then purchase the skin using coins. It has an expiration date, and since mine is expiring next week, I chose to use it on Miketsu. Let's try her out in a casual match. I was actually pleasantly surprised about how this looks like in-game. Her fox seems bigger, and the overall design seems more intricate. The only thing is that in the interface, her fox has a burning flame effect, but in-game, it's just a fire design in the tail. As for the skill effects, it's still the same as the original. Can we give it one last try before we say goodbye, goodbye, goodbye? Before we 
say goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Can we give it one more night? Can we give it one last fight? Cause if we ain't gonna, gonna try, then I guess, I guess we'll never know. Alrighty, I guess that's it for this Mikesu skin comparison video. Hope you guys enjoyed seeing all the different skins and the new effects and how the in-game skin differs from the interface. Comment down below which one is your favorite. Oh and by the way, did you guys enjoy the music for this video? If you did, check out Cupris on Spotify. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in our next video. Hi guys! As a big thank you to my subscribers, I'm currently running a school skin giveaway until the 31st of October. All you have to do is subscribe to my channel, turn on the notification bell, and comment the skin you'd like to win on the giveaway video linked down below. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video!